Well, we finally did it. We finally caught the creature that was getting into the chicken pens back here. And I'm gonna show you what we caught back here. So let's go look. I came out here today to check on everybody and see if they were all still okay. And I had set a trap. I had set a trap out here close to the chicken pen to see if we couldn't get whatever it was. I figured it was either a possum or a raccoon. Um, and so, yeah, so I'm gonna show you what we got out here. Like I said, this is who we caught out here. Mr. Raccoon has been out here dining on our chickens for several nights now. And so we finally caught him. So we're gonna have to uh, put him into the, the raccoon relocation program that we have out here. We'll probably take him off somewhere um, a long way from here and turn him loose, I guess, to uh, get him away from here. Can't let him loose out here because he will come back. They are uh, creatures of opportunity. If they find something that they can have a meal off of, they will keep coming back until there's not anything else to eat and then they go somewhere else. Anyway, so we're gonna probably uh, load him into the truck and take him off somewhere and let him find a new home. Well, we have more excitement out here on the farm today. We came out and checked and look at here. And we got another coon in the trap. We had caught one last week and relocated him. And I came out uh, yesterday, I think it was, to feed the chickens and noticed that some of the ground right along here had been dug around and like something else had been trying to get in there. And I just had a suspicion there might be another one out here. And so I reset the trap and sure enough, when we came out today, this is who's in there. He's not a happy camper either. So he will be a good candidate for the raccoon relocation program also. So I guess we'll just keep setting this trap until we don't catch anymore because I don't know how many's out here. There's no telling. 